It's Saturday night. It's the After Eight Mint Show with the E-Worms and me doing some turning in the background. Champion man. Good evening, everybody, and welcome again to a Saturday night mint where I will be in the background doing a bit of turning. And these guys. <laughs> Yeah, we'll be entertaining yeah. everybody, and that's how it works on a Saturday night. So I'm just and uh, just saw there, Sugar's got his um, usual drink of the evening. That's the one. <laughs> <laughs> and if every if anybody oh, was watching this MC this afternoon, that's one of the pieces that uh, Jake produced this afternoon. Yeah, pretty cool. Nice. There we go. Right. Show you guys back in the background. Um, change camera. Which one? Let's try that one. Yep, there we go. So tonight, what I've got on the lathe is um, a hunk of cherry, which I felled from in the garden last year, uh, about this time last year. And it's just been sitting around in the garden, uh, not doing very much. It's way out of balance. As you can see, um, it's about five inches deep, um, but there's a, a bit of rot on the outside. Um, plus, the pith is still in it as well. So it'll end up about three inches deep and around about 12 inches diameter. So I'll get on and do some turning. And Can I make guys... an observation, Wayne? Yeah. Just be careful. You're on camera. Just how much you're fondling that hunk. All right. Okay, we'll do. <laughs> okay. um, how, uh, okay. how how deep did you say it was going to be again? Real deep. Four inches. <laughs> Four inches. That's all it takes. Real That's deep. That's all it takes. <laughs> <laughs> Wayne's already like, why do I do this? <laughs> Go for it, Chuck. <laughs> go for it. Yeah, okay, let's go hey, for you, it. Right. Hey, you took that you took that breath, man. You took that breath like you're about to start. We're just let you have it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, you know it is. But anyway, in the chats we have uh Joey from Steel Bloodwood Works, Douglas Mungham, Door 60, the Ditch Finder General himself, Martin Reese, Shane Hurst, hey. uh Mr. Jake Thompson. Hey, there's a lot of that going on, Bobby. Uh, Wavy Woodshed, Scott from the Blue Light Turners Workshop. Evening, Scott. Hey, Scott. We've got hey. Matt Billy Brown and Weevo. Uh, Douglas Mungham. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Who else have we got in here? We've got Anita Ball. Evening, Anita. Uh, James oh, Crawford. Nice. Hodgepodge Woodworks. And Harry the Beaver. Mmm, nice beaver. We've got Norman Greenwell, uh, Barry Chitty, AGK Woodworks, uh, Andrew, Hello. Colin Izzard, and we've got Wayne the Woodturner, the Wood Jedi himself. Let's see if anybody else has uh, slipped in at the bottom. Who are Mrs. Who are that Christine and Michael Hesseltine's in. Hi, Christine Michael. Hello. Hi, Christine Ward, and Michael. Ward uh, Wilson is in. There's Howdy from the west coast of Arizona. Um, Carney, Carney. So good they named it twice. <laughs> I'm selling at a craft fair today, so cannot stay on. Good luck at the craft fair. Yeah, good, good luck. luck. Hope yep. you do well. Good luck. Uh, Susan Alan Swiss Gibb Woodburner is in. Is in. Alan Gibb, I, I haven't come across that one ever evening, Alan. Oh, yeah, there we go. And John Hayes. And I think we're all caught up at that point. So, good evening, everybody. Uh, Alan Gibb says, uh, Wayne and guys, how are you all doing? That's a big chunk of wood. What is it? Mm -hmm. It's cherry. Oh, cherry. Uh, and Wayne's really hoping that that faceplate can really hold on to it well because he doesn't want to lose his cherry tonight. Mm -hmm. um. <laughs> if you're late in, you've missed Wayne fondling a rather large hunk. <laughs> or you might, have, or you might have got lucky. 
and missed it. <laughs> uh, John Hayes has got a question. He said, can you scrimshaw on wood? No, only uh, bone. Oh, okay. What, what, what's, what's scrimshaw then, then JP? It's like uh, carving on bone. Oh, right. You know, like okay. ivory and all that sort of stuff. Uh, carving and putting holes in all that sort of stuff. It's Andrew, I isn't think it, from AGK? On, on, on wood, it would be called relief carving. Yeah. Ah, it would. Ah. Hmm. Uh, it's it's uh, Andrew, isn't it, from AGK? Do, what, yeah, it is, mate, yeah. Um, oh, cool. If you could do scrimshaw on um, wooden, then you used to sell it, you'd probably get sent out on a Tuesday by the owner who had done it. Yeah. Sent out on Tuesday. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, so Andrew from AGK Woodwork says, Ho oh, Shug, what? I missed that memo. When did I become one of those? <laughs> <laughs> Hiya, mate. Hiya. <clears throat> Scott said, uh, to lose his cherry is better than popping his cherry on camera. Wow. Oh, well, once you lose it, it's lost. That's open to debate. Well... Probably. <laughs> what kind of debate? <laughs> like the best one ever, like a master one? Like a yeah, like a really big debate, like a math debate. Master debate. Master debate. <laughs> <laughs> I remember asking Chris Q that on Makers International. Oh uh, about the mass debate. <laughs> about <Yeah>. the mass debate. <laughs> mask. <laughs> <laughs> Is it up for debate? It is. I think that was the first time he went silent. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, it appears that Scott didn't win on the Grand National. Ah well, Scott. <clears throat> another week of work, well, another year of work for you then. You got oh, this. Was it Grand National on the day? I believe it was. I told you once, I told you a thousand times, Scott. Them horses run faster than you. Yeah, you'll <laughs> never win. <laughs> Keep trying, though, buddy. Mind you, he, he did a lot better this year. I put a packet of bourbon, bourbon biscuits on the finish line. <laughs> he nearly got there. <laughs> All you want to do is take him to his head and say, I dangle just in front of his nose. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Look at Man. Wayne, he's cradling them shades. Oh, you know that's, that's, that's a good inspiration, that is, for a, uh, uh, for a question for the chat. Uh -oh. If Wayne was to have a horse running in the, uh, the Grand National, what would Wayne's horse be called? Justified in the you ancient. Know, you know you want to come up with some <laughs> horrible pun. Well, well, I I'm was like thinking, that. I was thinking, uh, ooh, meat on the hoof. Uh, meat on no, the hoof. I don't know. Meat on the hoof. <coughs> Mick, Mick says in. Meat uh, Douglas Bungham says red wine. There you go, not red rum. <laughs> uh, Betty Brown says shavings. Susie Swiss Footer says racy horsey. <laughs> Horse jerky. <laughs> and he, and he says ash. ash. Norman Greenwell says gallopy. Uh, Wilder Woodshed says can't see me for dust. <laughs> Barry Cheese says old nag. Jane Hurst says, you jerking, man. You jerking, man. Scott, the blue light turner says, it's uh, Cheerio Baby. <laughs> Andrew says, it's Mint Man. Uh, oh, I well, like Norman Greenwell. Who farted. <laughs> who farted. <laughs> John Hay says, whiskey turner. 
Douglas Mungham says Mick D. Norman. I think he's saying hi to people, mate. <laughs> I know. I don't think that's the horse's name. It's still a good name. Still a no, good no, name. I, don't, I really don't think that's the horse's name. But yeah, it's a oh good name. Oh Malcolm oh. Douglas is suggesting you call the horse Evening All. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I don't get your jokes, Jamie. Yeah, this is so rude. Katie's <laughs> in. Weird. Evening, Katie. And how's your oh, mother? Lady. How is How is mother Katie? I'm <laughs> Bottomless flask, said John Hayes. Oh, I like that. <laughs> I'd like a, I I'd wish. Like a, I'd like, yeah, I'd like a bottomless rum bottle. That'd be lovely. I don't have a drink problem until the bottle's empty. Oh, no, oh. Benjamin's here. What's up, man? He has food. Oh, sorry to hear that, Katie. Mm-hmm. Hope, she, uh, hope she starts to feel better soon. Douglas Mungham says, fill her up. <laughs> <laughs> Come up the rear to fill her up. Lauren Soldier calls in and he says, howdy, howdy to all my wonderful yeah, friends. <laughs> AGK says, hello, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Joey's going, Mike, Mike, Mike. I think he's just he's telling me to shut up. That's probably what he's doing. Yeah, that's what he meant last time. <laughs> <laughs> Joey will call it at the depot. At the depot. The depot runner. <laughs> Depot's Midnight Runners. This <laughs> mum will call it Alan, Alan, Alan. <laughs> <coughs> Katie, we're actually naming a, a horse that, uh, if Wayne owned a horse for the Grand National, what would it be called? Answers on a postcard, please. Just whop them in the chat. There's 43 hey, lovely that's people easy. watching. Mint. It is. Hey, 43 yeah. lovely people watching. Now, how does it go again, Jake? Hmm. A lot of people. Let me redo this. Let me do some math. <laughs> you do some math. Let <laughs> me do some math. How's that song? Oi, oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, fresh, fresh glue. Yeah, about twenty-six people have the opportunity to give Wayne a thumbs up at this point. I like it. Yeah. I like where Wayne's going with his shape. And that's a mighty fine opportunity. Yeah, there's a lot of this bit here is going to come off, um, um, because I'm trying to get it down to down to there. Yeah. So there's there's quite a lot of wastage on this, which you I probably should have. T- Probably should have taken off on the bandsaw. Yeah, you didn't know though till you start spinning it up what it's going to do, I suppose. Well, it's going to go round. Well, you're jogging, man. Eventually. Eventually. Uh, yeah, Benjamin said, Black Minty. That's a good call, Douglas. That, that, that's the opportunity they've all got there. To slam that thumbs button. Philip mm-hmm. Clement says hi all from Oz. Hello. Evening, Philip. Or in your case, probably morning, Philip. Hello, next week, uh, Philip. Hodge. I like that one, Hodgepodge. Fresh glue. I like that one. Okay. <laughs> Still in the blocks. <laughs> 
AGK says, you spin me right round. <laughs> Cornish mate, Katie says, uh-oh, no, that, uh, what is that? No, that have weird long names. Why don't you call it, someone's not turning that right. Here, hold my wine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Joey's going Joey round and round. Joey's round and round. He must be looking for a, a, a colleague in Home Depot. He's going round and round all day looking for one, mate. Somebody help me. Somebody help me. <laughs> God dang it. God dang it, Bobby. With no colleagues in Home Depot. Cartel. Hmm. Hard horse, and I asked for him. Got in as well. Excuse me, I'm actually not here and suggesting Sandy. No yeah, they could yeah. call it Sandy. <laughs> uh, AGK says, uh, do it for Yorkshire. <laughs> yeah, the Yorkshire Gritter. I had to read that twice from Ben there because I nearly, <laughs> nearly read that out without proofreading. You guys get much more stuff in your big box stores than we do. Oh, you've got Especially box envy, have you, Ben? <laughs> I'm glad you. I'm glad you proffery at it. <laughs> proffery at. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Browsing. You've been in for a while. What, again? Oh. <laughs> Seen again? <laughs> yeah. I just thought I'd say hello to him again. That's all right, mate. <laughs> Joey says it's because of our low IQ. <laughs> oh, <gasps> oh, 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 Katie. No. Oh. <laughs> Who's reading that out? <laughs> How about no? <laughs> Anyone got a bleep? <laughs> yeah, there's, a, there's another one I didn't let go through. My I know. I, 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 yeah, I saw that. <laughs> As our buddy Martin. Sometimes, sometimes you just got to let them stay there in limbo. <laughs> you know. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Joey, Joey says it's because of our low IQ. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Joey, do I detect some sarcasm there? <laughs> Mark the gentleman would turn us in. Hey, uh, Mark. Mark. Hello there. Let's give this gouge a quick sharpen. Give that gouge a quick sharpen. I was waiting for <laughs> Jamie to make an appearance, man. <laughs> Lawrence Aldrich says, what IQ still? I don't think I have an IQ. <laughs> Douglas Mallon says, Mark, great bowl in the pop-up. As long as it's not a pop-up tent. <laughs> uh, Mark said, he's in a room with a load of YouTubers and they're forcing him to drink beer, but don't send help. <laughs> <laughs> well done, mate. 
<coughs> Martin took an IQ test and it came back negative. <laughs> 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 oh, I got it. Joey says <clears throat> they love my IQ at Home Depot. Oh, your irritation quotient. I'm with you. Yeah, you get irritated very quickly in there, Joey. Don't you? <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all have irritated me, Bobby. <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah, uh, Mark, tell that the birthday to Steve for us. I'm not even getting the old whistle out, I think. Yeah. I think it's Monday his birthday is, but... Yeah, it's his birthday weekend, isn't it? Oh, so he's had it too early, then. Oh, that's all right. That's a sign of stop messing about. Look, look at the size of that tool. Oh, Ooh, there, Mrs. That's uh, what she said. Uh, Keep it classy, Huey. Right? And then she uh, <laughs> laughed. He had, the, he had that thing already. Already. <laughs> ready to go in the barrel. It was queued up. <laughs> Got it queued up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Bit too close, mate. Too. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, it's testing. That's Ooh. Wayne's cherry pie. Mm. Twelve inches deep and eight inches wide. <laughs> That's his cherry pie. <laughs> and she learned to breathe through her ears. Because <laughs> he's got a tongue that's 10 inches long. And he's learned to breathe through his ears. <laughs> Huey, just, Huey just did a Huey. <laughs> Huey just did a Huey. <laughs> no, Joey, it's Saturday night. <laughs> Full speed ahead. Whoosh, wait for the Backman Turner Overdrive. Oh. <laughs> Joey's like, oh my uh, Lord. Oh dear Lord. Sweet baby o Jesus. OMG. <laughs> OMG. <laughs> <laughs> That's more like it, Joey. Hammer down. I, I am impressed we have the same stupid songs all over the world. <laughs> <laughs> he says it's uh, Hammer Down, buddy. Hammer Down is eastbound down. I think what I'll do with this one is rough turn this one because it's soaking wet. So I'm going to rough turn this one and then return it at some point in the future. Yeah. So we can revisit this one. I like it. Yeah. I like it a lot. Nice. It's held on a faceplate ring, so I'm just going to take that off. Wayne's going to unscrew that ring. Oh See how many of these screws I can break? No, no. Sounds like wood. one. No. I've got great Wayne place. liked that piece of wood because he put a ring on it. <laughs> if you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. Wayne said, "You're joking, man! I like did." Should have put a ring on it. If you like it, should have put a ring on it. Jerry, stop! Hammer time! Do 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 do. Can't shop here. Do 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 do. Can't shop here. <laughs> <laughs> That's a rather large nugget of wood. 
Yeah, I, I can just I can just read the inflection in in Hodgepodge's there. Oh yeah, take it off, Wayne. Take it all off. Anime, yeah, anime, Huey. Do it again. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know. Yeah, Wayne. Take it off. Take it all off. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Joey says, Huey, you have an echo, it's puzzling. <laughs> echo, echo, echo. No, you just keep replaying it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's no echo, he's just us going, Alan, Alan, Alan. <laughs> ben, wait, no, no, put it back on again. <laughs> put it back on again. I think he's referring to the, take it all off, Wayne. <laughs> Stephen the Wood dude's in. Hello, right, Stephen. Hey, hello there. Hello, hey, hey guys, did you notice Wayne turned the ball around? What, Wayne's turning. <laughs> so, so the other thing is, uh, Corner Smith said, "I wonder if we had any new viewers at that point." And then Wood dude gets in here and says, "Evening all." <laughs> <laughs> Douglas Mungham says, "Wayne, how do you manage the kindergarten?" <laughs> well, what, what happens is, Douglas, is Wayne gets sent accidental free pies and then he dishes them out to us. Yeah. <laughs> but we're pretty self sufficient. <laughs> <laughs> so he said, at least he's not interrupting you. <laughs> I'm glad you did that, JP, because I thought it was kind of garden. I was going to say, what kind of garden? <laughs> I've heard of kind of eggs. <laughs> no, they've all been taken off the shelf. They've all been recalled, mate, because of uh, those two people again. You know, Sam, Sam and Ella. Oh, <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> Sam and Ella. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> oh, yeah, I get it now, Joey. Yeah, yeah, I've got an echo, and the echo is JP, but at least he's not interrupting you. Woohoo! <laughs> Jake was the interrupter bottom today. today. <laughs> so i got to get you back sometime. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's got a few free tickets to use. Yeah, I have a lot. Then, then again, Joey, at, at least I was good enough to show up for Saturday morning cartoons. Hoo-hoo, burr. Oh, oh, How do you like that, oh, burr? Oh, that's a scorcher. Terry Cox is in. Evening, Terry. And he right, says, Terry. All hail the Turning King. Hey, hey. Right, just a couple of cracks across here, so I'm just going to try and get rid of them as much as I can. Is it soaking wet in there too? You never lie. <laughs> so, so I've just made Joey do exactly the same as what I have to do all of the time. Joey just <laughs> explained the joke to me. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <clears throat> Joey says, number one, JP, number one. I should get that on a t-shirt. Mm. Joey says, I'm number one. I can send you the picture <laughs> of the hands we made today. <laughs> <clears throat> is, is it holding one finger up for me? Both of them are. <laughs> nice. Terry Cox is here. He says, Hail to the Turning King. Mm -hmm. You can say hello to Wayne in here if you like as well. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh <laughs> why did you. I'm going to say, why did Wayne's you go to the Wayne's, Wayne's the Wood Jedi. 
Philip Jay's in. What? Just I don't even do that much turning, so he can't be talking about me. He must be on about Jay. Ooh. <laughs> exactly Ooh. What I was Ooh. About. Ooh. <laughs> I'm just like, why did he come to? Why did he go to Wayne's channel to find Jamie? <laughs> you got it. Muddy Duck Workshops in, <clears throat> and they have a question. <laughs> do you have a kiln-like object, or do you air dry, Wayne? <clears throat> I air dry. Mm hmm. Okay. With his with his air dryer. <laughs> with his hot air stripper. You can't beat an hot air stripper. Either uh, air dry and turn twice, or if it's really really wet, I'll turn it very very thin, and then let it warp. Well, he turns at warp speed, so he might as well. <laughs> hey! Turn, turn, warp, turn, warp, turn, warp. Oh, it's a bit of fighting, that one. Okay, Philip J is in. Philip J is in the chat. Hello, Philip. Hello. How are you doing? Mm -hmm. Okay. Just just said, said, okay. I like that right there. Flinging stuff everywhere. Look at the streamers. Mm -hmm. Nice. I like it. Uh, Katie's asking, if you had logs to dry, could you not put them next to the log burner or something? I could, but they'd probably end up cracking. Because of the speed you're drying them. Especially, especially cherry, which is prone to crack very fast. Cherry, yeah. And then you'd end up losing your cherry, obviously. Well, at least it's next to the burner after that. <laughs> ben says, uh, look at those shavings, proper <laughs> carrot peelings. No, it's, yeah. uh, it's definitely cherry, not carrot. <laughs> what? Uh, Wayne, camera! 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 camera. 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 You've, you've, you've got your camera. Camera! <laughs> Wayne! Wayne! <laughs> Wayne! There's a camera! <laughs> there you go. Uh, there you go. Okay. Mark, Martin's got it. He said they dry even faster in the log burner. <laughs> yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. He, John, he would sell the shavings as packaged stuff in, but then he wouldn't have a carpet because he's got a lovely carpet there to stand on. Takes the uh, Mark Stroughton's in. Evening, Mark. Hello, Mark. Hello, Mark. Hey, Mark. Yeah, 52 wonderful people in. Nice. 52 people in. 52 people in. I was only thinking the same. Thing. Films. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it was only a matter of time, Jake. 27 minutes to go. 27 minutes to go. 52 people in the chat. 52 people in the chat. <clears throat> so 22 have an opportunity. <laughs> Push that thumb <laughs> like that. <laughs> Chuck, camera. Camera. Is that oh, your camera? Oh. oh, yeah, I see. Oh. I think I've got it. Well spotted, that man. Philip J said he's been says, so busy at work, uh, he thought he would get time to turn this weekend, but no luck. Haven't even been into the workshop, so now we'll have to watch someone else turning and feel sorry for you for himself. Nah, you'll be all right, mate. Nah, you'll be all right. Yeah. Bye. Right. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Jim said, lights! Lights! <laughs> Camera! And action! <laughs> Colin Chalmers is in. This is hi guys. Hello. 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 Um, Ben's got uh, a, an opportunity for you, Wayne. He said, What's "In up? hindsight, um, in hindsight, maybe you could refrain from bumping the camera in future." Kind regards, Ben. 
Look, there's an opportunity for you as well, Ben, to shut your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> shut okay. your dirty mouth. <laughs> you put it. You have to put a hashtag, and then it's not rude, right? Oh yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Hashtag, hashtag shut, shut your mouth. mouth. <laughs> That's why Ashley ain't here, because of because of my new hashtag. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> Steel Blitz said, "Mouth, mouth, mouth, <laughs> mouth, mouth." <laughs> <laughs> oh. It would be so mad. <clears throat> It would be so mad if Joey was coming over for makers, honest to God. That would be awesome. <laughs> yeah, that, that would be. be. Yeah. There's one there for you as well, Joey. There's an opportunity for you to come over to makers. <laughs> Here's one. <laughs> and Jamin says, hashtag zip it, Jamie, you silly sausage. <laughs> hey! <laughs> silly sausage. Okay. <laughs> hashtag. Okay. We need Joey over here for makers. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure we could buy an LD store on uh, Amazon or something you can cook for us. Hey. <laughs> he figure it out. He'd make something out of something. Okay, yeah, make a little sum sum. Yeah. I'm sure, uh, I'm sure Huey can get out of a um, massive chunk of metal. Yeah, and then and then Joey can cook for us, and me and Joey will be the security guards on that day, and we'll be protecting the El Disco. You won't even get a look in Jay, I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's nice. Look at that wood. Right. Yeah. Real pretty. This one is about done to where I'm, as far as I wanted to take it. You're 23 minutes to go. That's okay. I'm going to pop in the house and um, grab uh -oh. a couple of pieces from in the house. So that's the the piece of cherry. Nice. Yeah. Uh, you can actually see the difference in colour. This is starting to dry out after it's been cut. Yeah. But you see how yeah. dark that is? That's because it's yeah, still wet. Nice. Absolutely. Um, so I'll stick that in a bag of shavings and leave it a couple of months and then come back and refinish it. And if you just bear with me, I'll just pop in the house and get a couple of pieces that we can get um, finished off. I've got one piece to finish off, and I've got another piece, which I did on Wednesday night, the, the hydrated bull, which ah, I'm not mm -hmm. happy about. So we're going to repurpose that one. I'll be nice. Back nice. Hey, yeah. Dance like a monkey, Jamie. Dance like a monkey. Katie yeah. says, uh, deep in the heart of Texas. There we go. Yeah. Andrew says, uh, get on a flight, Joey. No, uh, no, no, no. Andrew says, get on a fight, Joey. Yeah, the oh. fight's on when he That's gets over here. That's not a bad here. idea. That's not a bad idea. If I abuse Joey you. enough, <laughs> if I abuse Joey enough, he might come over here. So you lot will benefit, and I'll just be not here no more. We'll get benefit in. Oh, definitely. I can tell him there's a home depot here. <laughs> Um, Jim Spalding said he had not worked in the shop since before Christmas rush, getting everything done. He went out today and it's a wreck. He's been cleaning and vacuuming, and then the <laughs> Texas heat set in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice one, mate. Nice one. The Texas heat will get you. Mine's yeah. got it. Jamie, just tell him you've got taco trucks. Hell, it might. Oh, we've work. got uh, we've got uh, we've got Mexican food over here, but it's not real Mexican food. No, it won't be as good as Joey's. It's, 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 a proper, uh, it's a proper uh, English version of Mexican food. <laughs> that means it's still <laughs> fake Mexican food. Shh, shh. Hold on. It's, Ben's, it's Ben's for English version, though. Oh, okay. Jake, Jake, kick Ben because he's, he's worked it out. Look, what Wayne meant to say is he's popping in the house for a pint of wine. Hey, it's already out there. Okay. It's already <laughs> it's, out there. It's a proper pint, though. Yeah, proper mm. pint. It's a real pint. Proper. <clears throat> It's not proper. I, I said I said that I, I did I, I did agree to that. I did say it wasn't proper Mexican, but it's a proper English version of Mexican. <laughs> You'll find some way to make it okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Martin Bree said, back. we don't have real Mexican food here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Katie thought your house was the other way, Wayne. You oh, probably right. confused her. Oh. <clears throat> now I know which right. way to go. Actually, so, looking at it, looking at it, it actually is. What? I don't know why you walk that way around. <laughs> because it's easier walking that way around than walking this way around. Yeah, because there's, right. there's a massive pile of shavings there. He can't get past them anymore. They flick yeah, off the end go. of the gouge. <laughs> right. This was the piece from Wednesday night, the Hydra Dip Bowl. And as you can see, there's a lot of wood showing through. There's still bubbles on it. And I'm just not happy with it. So that's going to get redone. And this is the piece that I did on the virtual craft show. Um, so it's black on the bottom with a bit of, um, I think it was silver embellished and wax. I put it in that. And then a green water drop bowl. And we're just going to finish this one off. But nice. first, I'll do the other one. Douglas Mullen says, JP just had more beans. <laughs> <clears throat> no, just refry them. Refried beans. Keep refrying them. <laughs> no, good in my house. I usually do them in the microwave. <clears throat> Oh, hold no, on a minute. Yeah. Ben says, Katie, I was thinking the same thing. And then Katie says, oh, my God, Ben. <clears throat> ben thought the same as me. Great minds and all that lot. No, no, Katie, oh. I think I think that might actually mean that you're as strange as the rest of us. <laughs> yeah, I have too many beans. It'll be like that scene from Blazing Saddles. <laughs> Mine says here they put refried beans in breakfast burritos. It's weird. And tasty. Tasty. <laughs> so, so, Jamie, did you have refried beans while you was over there? Um, I don't think I did. No, I didn't. I don't think I had Mexican food in the States. Well, when you go there, have refried beans. Just so that you can tell us what the hell it is. It's re I've refried had, beans. I've, I've, I've had, uh, what it grits. is, Shug, it, it's beans that have been mashed up and fried. That's what it is. Yeah, what kind I've of beans had, are we talking I've about? Just, uh, I mean, you can use any sort of beans. You can use uh, pinto beans. You can use... Um, God, I've forgotten the name of the beans that you get in ordinary baked beans now. <laughs> that, that, that said, I will <laughs> mail you some. That'll be one messy package by some <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you send it out on a Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday mail. <laughs> by, the time it's been bean. Through, by the time it's been through the ditch and that lot. <laughs> <laughs> Katie says Harico? Question mark. That's what I said. Yep, yeah. Harico. Yeah, fried in bacon grease. All right, okay. Yeah, I've had uh, oh, I've had grits right. before. That's uh, that's an unusual taste. Harico. Yeah, but and it's spelled Haricot. I'm not. I'm, I don't know. I'm just. It is. Seem to it remember. Is. Yeah, I thought. Oh, yeah. Jim Smolding said, "Did you say Tuesday?" Yes, we said we. <laughs> we will. <laughs> we will see if it arrives on Tuesday. <laughs> I'm still stuck on bacon <laughs> grease. <laughs> Did somebody say bacon? Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> them canned beans a long time in that ditch. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you send the uh, you send the beans, Martin. I'll make sure he gets a spot of dick. <laughs> ah. You ain't giving me no spotty dick, boy. <laughs> uh, Douglas Munger was asking JP, "What are grits?" It's corn, isn't it? Corn, I think it is. Mashed up corn. Mashed up corn. Ah. Oh. Somebody, somebody did mention that before. <clears throat> I actually thought. Oh, I was no one there. 
that old, old show called Mel's Diner or whatever that lady used to say, kiss my grits. So I never had grits. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> Muddy Duck Workshop says, grits are nasty. It's one I of those things you have uh, to be brought up with. I could quite easily send Martin some of their meatballs made by the company Brains. You mean? Oh, faggots. You mean, you mean faggots? <laughs> yeah, them ones. You guys, <laughs> you guys kill me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you, you say you say that, Jake, but wait till you've tried them. They're actually really nice. And it's, and it's not nice thinking that you're going to go back to the States and tell everybody... Yeah, while I was over in the UK, I had faggots in my mouth. They're going to be like, why didn't you just try them while you were here? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty, pretty expensive trip to try something you can get here. <laughs> uh, Chisky said it was Flo that said kiss my grits. Yep. <laughs> Kiss my grip. Kiss my grip. Yeah, Joey said, I'll show JP the proper way us low IQ individuals cook one day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's going to happen, too. It's going to happen. Yeah, definitely. Got to happen. Uh, um, video footage or it never hey, happened. He says she's never had Mexican food. Whoa. One day we'll get Joey doing a demo and how it's cooked. Ben, ben said he don't think he's ever had Mexican food from a restaurant. Well, you can, a, get it take, I don't, you can get takeaway. I don't know whether it's still there, but there's a fairly nice one up in in Scarborough when we went. Uh, we had some up there. It was <coughs> wicked. Um, whereabouts was that? Uh, I'm trying to think now where it was. It was. Uh, it's attached to a hotel. Is uh, that? Is it sort of? Up on the top of the cliffs, overlooking the yes, beaches and stuff. Yes, yes, it's up on yes, the top. I'm, yeah, yeah. I'm forgetting the name of the place now, but it is very good. I've been there a couple of times. Yeah, it's, it's, we loved it when we were there. We were stopping in that hotel because uh, my auntie Wendy made um, years and years ago. She did all the the soft furnishings for in there, and uh, she got us the, the the place in there. And then she said, "Oh, you must try the restaurant downstairs." And we were like, "Yeah, okay." And they brought it up to the room and everything. So we were like, "Okay, we'll have a go at this." And it was wicked. I'd never had Mexican before that. Mm. <clears throat> I don't know if it's real bona fide, but it's as, about as good as I'm ever going to get, I'm guessing. Right, where's Brushy? I got a feeling Jamie's in for a treat when it comes down. Oh, yeah, time. without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah, if you call it beating a treat, you're going to get that and some El Disco. <laughs> you get El Disco first, and then yeah, a damn good, good. beating. <laughs> Take the good with the bad, man. You have, you yeah. really do, you really do have it coming. So just take it. Uh, Martin uh, says we had an exchange student from Denmark. She said there they call cigarettes fags. They do here as well, mate. Yeah, they do yeah, here they as do. well. Oh, he said, well, they're smoking a fag is a whole different <laughs> meaning here. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. See, the, the, it does get very confusing for for people from abroad because we call cigarettes fags, and the the um, meatballs that Jamie's talking about, they're mm. called faggots. Yeah. But I mean, they've they've got meat and kidney and heart and liver in them. Hmm. <laughs> Brushy. No, it's only brew. I've just there we go. <laughs> so that's changed. That I'll, you'll be able to see the texture in better when I bring it up to the camera. Can you uh, can we'll you just quickly show Brushy again on camera? Of course I can. <laughs> of course. Oh, hold Vicky back. <laughs> see, oh, uh, no. you, that's what you use to clean your workshop. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> dear me! Did anybody notice how low that that boy had to stoop he, to kick me that hard? He had to get Wayne involved too, man. He had to, yeah, it was a whole yeah, setup. It's terrible, Connie. It's gonna be okay. She's she was like some vegan fags, I guess. I don't know how that's gonna work. <laughs> oh, they're still possible, but you only get them in America. 
<laughs> yeah, the vegan countenance. vegan fags don't eat meat. <laughs> oh, what's why Vicky's here is here put on lemon oil. Wrap your yeah. brain around that one. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, well, spe spe speaking of uh, vegan fags, that's all Vicky's brother is. <laughs> Jamie. Jamie, we're gonna get oh, fired. Oh, oh, I don't even. I mean, we're gonna get just fired, and we don't even have a job. <laughs> just do me a fa just do me a favor, Jamie. Just check your belly and make sure there ain't no dust on it, because I think you've just slid it across the floor. That's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Connie says it's not because it's meat. It's because it's organ meat. Like a big piano? Organ? <laughs> I have no idea, but that's conjured Could up some be. images. Now, a yeah. Like a keyboard? <laughs> like a church keyboard? <laughs> no, she said. Connie said, organ. <laughs> <laughs> right, so that's uh, repurposed that one. Connie, oh, Katie right. says, it's a bit like strawberry milk. Someone said it's vegan because it comes from strawberries. <laughs> so hopefully you can see the... Oh, really the here, that put on that's there. nice, mate. That's really there, nice. Yeah. So that's that one. Like I say, I wasn't happy with the, the Hydra dip that, that I did. So you can always repurpose <laughs> things if you're not happy as, with them. As Jen would say, that's the good one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Jen. Jenny, Jen, Jen, Jen. That was wicked. Oh, dear. I can just hear it now. Jamie! I'm going to slap you. She went uh, crazy. As soon as she saw that lemon oil, she went, she's all <laughs> getting crazy out there. Oh, yes, Ben, good point. Uh, he says, if you ever visit the UK, you should try haggis. They sell it yep. in tins at pets at home. Haggis is lovely stuff. <laughs> I had uh, deep fried haggis last time I was in Scotland. It was really nice. <laughs> well, actually, it's battered haggis. Yeah, battered haggis. <sighs> oh. <laughs> right, so to finish off this evening, we'll just. Camera! <laughs> <laughs> Say hi, mate. Yeah. He got us, mate. That's what she said. Hey. <laughs> I, I, just, I nearly told a joke there. Forgot I'm not I, on Patreon. I don't. I don't know what's funny at <laughs> Ben's or Connie's. <laughs> Connie says, "Okay, okay, I'll say it. I ate meat for the first time in years." I'm not even reading the rest, Connie, because that's hilarious. <laughs> oh, sorry. No, there is the rest. It says, I didn't like it, but I'm trying to do low carb and it's impossible without meat. <laughs> cheeky girl. <laughs> cheeky girl. Hey, you cheeky girl. Oh, Muddy Duck says you can get canned haggis in the US, but the real deal is illegal. It is, yeah. <laughs> what, about, what about blood sausage? Or black pudding, as we call it. Oh, black pudding. Oh, don't, Jamie. Oh, I could do with some of that now. Yeah. We gave that a go one over. I presume that would be illegal if uh, Haggis is. <laughs> Terry Cox well, says know, refried only, greens. It, it's only, um, it's only well, blood. blood and fat. Yeah. Terry Cox says refried beans are traditionally made with pinto. <laughs> they're they're pinto just beans. cooked and mashed. Yeah, they're just cooked and mashed. Just remember, never trust a bean fart after 50. <laughs> I learned never to trust a fart after I was about one one year old. <laughs> <laughs> uh, always be suspicious. Me, 
I know. Keep it classy, Vicky. <laughs> yeah, keep it classy. Hashtag. Oh, AGK Woodworks. No, no, no. <laughs> it's the shizzle, I'm telling you. <clears throat> B Brown says you can also get white pudding. Mm hmm. I wonder if there actually is a uh, an American version of uh, the meatballs we mentioned earlier in the States. And I mean the food version. Mm. <laughs> well, certainly uh, there was a guy um, on a food program once. I can't remember which one it was. But this was an English guy who had actually gone across to the States and opened a fish and chip shop. And That's he actually thing. did. He actually made his own haggis. But without any of the um, the awful. Oh, okay. Oh, that's awful. That is. Oh. So Ben's got a question. Uh, so here's a question for you: uh, Should a full English have chips? Take no. out the tom take out the tomatoes and put the chips in. <laughs> Yeah, that's okay, here's a question now. Here's a question now, Jack. What kind of tomatoes? Fried tomatoes uh, or tin tomatoes? No, don't tomatoes. care. Don't care. Get them out of there. You just, you're yeah. just not a tomato fan. No tomatoes. Do we look like we're you know we we want to be yeah. vegetarians? Well, it's, no. it's just I think that's one of those American things that's just just not heard of for breakfast. <clears throat> it is it is traditional here, but no. I just push them to the edge of play, or if I get the option, I go hold the tomatoes because I don't want them because they yeah gross. Okay, here's another question. Then here's another question: bacon roll. What sauce are you having? No, I don't know. No, what did you say? Bacon None roll. What red. sauce are you having? None. Not that. Not that brown stock sauce stuff. No. Mm -hmm. Right. Do you think you need to cook the highlights on this? <clears throat> no, I Jay's don't think it's lines. Nope. It is beautiful. Right, here we go. I'll just quickly. And a lot of a lot of yeah. people say, I say a lot of people, two people out there are saying brown. Uh Terry's saying, yeah, but one of them's Vicky, so that don't count because she's only doing it to curry your favour. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Jamie says mayo, mustard and ketchup all mixed up. That sounds disgusting. Yeah. Terry Cox says, Arthur Treacher's fish and chips. I don't know who Arthur Treacher is, but fish and chips is a winner. Only in the UK, though. Only in the UK. <clears throat> oh, no. Scott's got daddy issues. Hey. Hey. He wants daddy his daddy sauce. Do you remember um, um, what's that, Frank Bruno? Potter sauce, sorry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean, Abby. Big Feet eases in. Hello, Hello Wayne and Auntie Val. Wayne hey, and yes. Annie Val. Hello, Wayne and Valerie. Trisky says, I guess you guys don't eat uh, brain's eggs either. What wow. the hell's brain's eggs? I don't know. I eat uh, brain's faggots. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, Vicky and, said she wanted to say daddy's, but she knew that us guys wouldn't keep it classy. Uh, try to keep those away from her mouth. She... Oh, Connie. She's hot French fries dipped in a vanilla milkshake. Hey, don't hey, don't knock it. Connie's on to something. It's I was going to say, uh, <clears throat> Vicky not, vanilla, not vanilla, but if you was to say strawberry or banana, Chocolate. I, I, might be, I might be tempted to join you with that one. No. Um, Joey says, uh, we Not have barbacoa. What's barbacoa? Uh, it sounds like he's trying to say barbecue. Nope. So kind Is of it a meat. Spanish word, Joey? He'll, he'll have to explain it. We have a barbacoa. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> don't make no sense. I love how you try to be Spanish to us. There we go. I'm going to write a comment in one <laughs> <that. laughs> <laughs> 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 He said, nope. <laughs> Put the nope. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie, where did you where did you learn your your, your um, Mexican accent from? Is it from that mouse on the on the cartoon? Same place as he learned his Austrian one from. Rodriguez. <laughs> he said I said it uh, correctly. He said he's very surprised. <laughs> <clears throat> you be right, careful. Camera. Be essay next and all sorts. Okay. Right, so. I did the, the cherry piece, which will get turned again in a few months. That, again, that's the ash piece that I've repurposed. That's nice. And yeah, put some texturing on there. I really like that piece right in the middle. Mm. And, yeah, that's really cool, isn't it? And this is the the mint water drop bowl from the, the Virtual Crafty. And I have to say, Wayne, that today. is mint. <clears throat> mint. Definitely. Joey says it comes from the cheeks of a cow. Uh, ben Jones says you can actually buy pre-mixed mayo and ketchup. It's called burger sauce, Ben. <laughs> okay. Oh, Jim Spalding okay. saying, and, and, and I don't even want to go here, but it's, it sounds like Conchita Bibil. I'll leave that one for you, what Jamie. Is, what does that mean, Joey? <laughs> if you can write it in Thanks, here. Thanks, Jim. Right, let's bring the guys back in. No, yeah, don't do yeah, it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, here we go. Oh, hey. Come on, get dressed. <laughs> Stay hydrated, <laughs> my golly. Right, I hope you enjoyed tonight. I was um, something, well, not different, but you got one unfinished project and two finished projects tonight. For a change. So, so Jamie, he made three bowls tonight. Which one did Jen like? <laughs> I reckon the water drop one. The other ones were rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> you can be sure whichever one she likes the other ones are trash there's only going to be one good one <laughs> anyway, I've got the two trash ones that she doesn't like here they're getting ready to be burnt <laughs> see if you can throw them and see if Wayne can catch it <laughs> we, we, should do that one. we should do that one day I should throw them like yeah. that and send them yeah, to Wayne and grab them. From it. there you go <laughs> And Martin said, very educational show. I learned a lot today. Nothing about wood turning, of course. Uh, <laughs> hey, Connie's hungry you get, now, though. You got, you got <laughs> a little culture. Got cultured a little bit today, Martin. There you go. Uh, Jim what says, on that? a serious note, we have a link for Wayne. Question mark? Buy me a coffee uh, at the top of the chat. Yeah, if it's that Buy one you're on about. Coffee, yeah. coffee, wine. Go and do don't it. forget, if you enjoyed it, Smack the thumbs for Wayne. I'm sure he's right. going to appreciate. In in my is description, it? Jim. In my description, there is a link to my <clears> link tree, <throat> which has all my social media on there. Also, my uh, PayPal me and buy me a coffee. And there's also a link to the buy me a coffee at the top of the chat as well. Sweet. And Wayne's merch store as well. So if you want a t-shirt, he's got, got a few on there. Well. He's, he's got loads of different designs in there. Oh, a mint. Yeah, he's got one on there that just goes, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. And on the back, it's a... Right. No, the, <clears throat> the link at the top of the chat, Jim, is to buy me a coffee where you can make a donation to the, the channel. Um, if you go to YouTube and just type in Win the Wood Turner, that'll bring my channel up. Um, no, on Instagram, I am Win the Wood Turner 2 because I got hacked once. And on Facebook, I'm on as Win the Wood Turner. Yeah. Okay. Just... Yeah, he's found it. There we go. Happy days. It. it was like, okay, Super. enough. Stop it. Shut okay. your yeah. Shut <laughs> mouth. Shut your mouth. <laughs> Shut your birdie mouth. <laughs> right. It, it has it has gone the hour by nearly five there minutes. What's going on, Bobby? So, um, I'm going to press the button and go indoors and grab a glass of wine. As per usual. Thank you, Casey. Is that in the search bar? <laughs> We're changing lives here. We are changing and we'll, lives. And we nice will be posting it on Tuesday. 
<laughs> right, I'm pressing the button. Here we go.